Dinner time already? Um, no, the thing is... Uh... I'm anyone's for a chicken tikka, just in case you're wondering. Yeah, Maury's asked me to visit some of our buyers. I'm sorry. Oh, no biggie. I'm free tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow I'll be in France. Oh, when a bloke asks me out, his first instinct isn't usually to flee the country. <laughs> <laughs> Could uh, bring you back some onions. Yeah, and I got back from France a few days ago. I've got all the onions a girl could wish for. If I could get out of it, I would. I'll be back in a few weeks. Weeks? Yeah. Miss me? Pa! Behave. <laughs> You'll be ancient history long before then. Yeah. Heartbreaker. Oh, yeah, you better believe it. <laughs> No need charity. Sammy, get back in your pram, love. It's to celebrate you getting your job back. Oh, sus. Thanks, pet. Oh, cheers, I can murder a coffee. Not happy with you. Oh, we're not going to have a fight, are we? Well, we will do if you keep packing my prospective fellas off to France. Ah. Why couldn't you go? Because I hate France. Wait on. Well, I'm not sure he's that much of a good catch anyway. Who asked your opinion? Oh, come on, Chaz. Is it such a crime that me and Kane might want to have a bit of space? Hang on, was this Kane's idea? No, of course not. Don't try and defend him. I know what he's like. No, it was a mutual decision. When is my brother ever mutual? I find a decent bloke who actually might make me feel good and not murder my relatives, and he can't wait to stay the boot in. Well, you know what? Not having it. Mind the bar while you die, Anne. Chaz, you're overreacting. I haven't even started. Them pills don't seem to be working. Oh, that's this. Yeah, I was, until you packed James off to France. <sighs> it's a business trip. You just can't help yourself, can you? Me, Debbie, Charity, you think that we all need your approval. Are you never going to get the message? Fine, if you're happy for him to mess you about. No, you're the one that's messing. So what? He's got a bit of history, but who hasn't? Oh, is that what you told Dan? And look how that turned out. Oh, I don't want to marry the bloke. I just want to have a bit of fun. And thanks to you, he's probably going to cop off with some French bird and forget all about me. Then I've done you a favour. Well, you know what? If he doesn't, when he gets back, I am going to give him a night that he is never going to forget. And don't even think about trying to stop me. <laughs> 